Today's video, we start with a hydration chart. Am I hydrated? Aim for clear urine at least 10 times a day. Eat a diet rich in fresh fruits and vegetables. Drink a quart of water before meals. Thank you. So here, Hualampong Station, Bangkok, got a first class sleeper. Check it out, so you get James Bond style. Welcome to Durian's Providers Hotel. That's what you get. This is all my luggage. I could travel for over a year with this luggage here in Thailand. Just a bag, a couple of kilos there, laptop. Your pillow, this is your basically your bunk, a little sink there, and some water, stay hydrated. So that's what you get for about 50 bucks US. I'm gonna go to overnight Chiang Mai, it's so about 12 hours, 14 hour trip. I'm gonna get a lot of sleep because we're gonna go up Doi it to non. Some hard training coming up in Chiang Mai, rest up, carb up, fucking live hard. So just come and make a little bit, check it out, check it out, check it out, check it out. It's the top bunk my bag and my bike helmet and then we go down below. Isn't this romantic? I'll be having a night with Mrs. Palm, that's for sure. Because Freely's back in Australia. Just woken up on the train to Chiang Mai. We're about an hour from the uh, chair at the window here. Chair at the window. Can't probably can't really see much, but we're about an hour from Chiang Mai. Some native Thai forests there. Very full of opium poppies. And I've uh, got to get Chiang Mai, get my bike out of the cargo hall, jump on my bike ride straight to the fruit market, get breakfast. That's what I love about the bike. You don't have to get in a taxi and then barter with the taxi. Have you got the meter on how much? Oh, a little bit this, a little bit like just fucking around. You wanna go boom boom? You wanna go strip car? You wanna have daddy boy? You wanna get some? You know, just all this crap with the taxi drivers. In general, not always, but that's fine, that's Thailand. But I prefer just getting on my bike, getting the job done. Bring your bike to Thailand, or bring your fast wheelchair to Thailand much easier to get around with your own wheels. Thank you very much. How good was that? It's pretty efficient. I don't mess around here. I don't mess around here. What do you think of McDonald's kids? Brainwash the young generation with a message. Or ask those kids about McDonald's. So where is my bike, you may ask? My bike is down the cargo hall. It's cost 90 baht, which is about three dollars US, all the way to Chiang Mai. So. It's easy man, I love the bike, I've saved so much time and money today riding around Bangkok, it's just like, the traffic here is crazy, busy as fuck, it's probably the busiest traffic in the world I reckon, I've never seen such kilometre long standstills, crazy, why would, I mean, catching a taxi, are you fucking serious? That would drive me insane in peak hour traffic, maybe from the airport or so, but not around the city, no way. So you can see behind me, they've got my bike already for me, that's the little seat. Bangkok. So grab that, put the helmet on, go ride the fruit market. How's that for service? On the train station here, you got all the traditional farang, smoking, eating shit, jumping the taxi, do the whole tourist fucking trap thing. I've got my garment on here. I just punch in hotels, just ride around, see what I like. Fucking easy, fucking easy, man. So the lads, Martin and Jason, got the bikes. Spin up the tap. tap. I'm gonna smash down some mangoes, the Nam Dot Myers. I find with the black spots on them, generally indicates that it means they're ready to eat. Generally. Generally. They're fucking tasty and sweet. Mango skins were flying. A little bit landed on the Cannondale. Black spot mangoes sugar sweet. Really good 
massage, 150 bar, about five bucks for an hour and a half. This Thai lady smashed my back up, did a great job. Legs, arms, face, everything. Thai massage here. This is where the location is. A little old school, old school hunt. And there's another sign there. So if you go and pass, remember where it is. It's right next to the river. And it's next to my hotel I recommend called Marina Hotel. Very close to you see the fruit market just down here. Great location. Massage, fruit, close to the mountain, not far from Green Lake as well. See you soon. Looking back, I've got the bike down here on the, in the little chain by river. Got some mangoes here. So we do lunch Thai style. Fruit for breakfast and lunch, fruit for dinner often. Or one of the vegan cafes in Bang uh, Thai, uh, Chiang Mai. We were in Chiang Mai. I did a wicked ride this morning, 18 kilometer time trial. Up Doyce and Tepsi, very top, but third overall um, behind two pro riders. Quite a good, good workout. We'll show you the climb. We'll show you the climb. So this is the dinner. Vegan tucker. A little bit of curry over there. I've got five rices. Get some more. Big carb fest for the gang. <laughs> How's the curry funga good? Oh, it's great, man. Steroids are kicking in. Steroids are kicking in. What would you like to see more about Chiang Mai? Post it down below. The camera just cut out. We had a great dinner tonight. Fucking feasting every night here. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Great times in Chiang Mai. Please bring your bicycle. It's having no bicycle in Chiang Mai is like having what's that like? How can you how can you experience a place without a bicycle? Every burn fat, not oil whenever possible. See you soon. Post down below what would you like to see? Muscle man. Seriously though, burn fat not oil. Why well, contribute more traffic if you can have your bicycle? Why miss out on valuable base training? Burning some fats. Burn the fat not the oil. Every time you're in a taxi or a car, you could be burning fat. That's my philosophy for a long time. Burn fat, not oil. Save the planet when you can.